also with the new technology as a base, we really need to change the way we work internally uh, to be able to be more agile and more relevant to the customer. She's leading a global organization in constant change and she has more than 25 years of experience within this highly competitive industry. Welcome up, Anneli Nesean. Before, when I used to doing some transformation within the company, I have the, the vision and the goal really 100% set and the, you know where we are and the gap how to come there. So the plan is quite rigid, but this time actually the goal is it's not so clear because it's agile and we don't really know where we should be 2023 right now because the world is changing so rapidly. The management team are used to you just putting out the direction and now it's okay that you don't really know where to go, but you will do that as a team together. Uh, insight, uh, insight about uh, change and how to do that and how to transform in a more digital way and why is that different than transformation in a more ordinary way. So it's uh, team development actually, and starting with the leaders. First of all, maybe you have the, the culture. The, it's a big difference for a Japanese colleague than a Norwegian one because we have a different uh, starting point if you talk to the, about the digital knowledge. Um, but it's also the distance because you have to do everything. You, you can't see all the colleagues every day, so you have to do it in the digital way, but also through the management system. First of all, you have to uh, know why, why you're doing this, what do you want to accomplish. Secondly, to have the vision. I mean, it's not 100% clear, but you have to understand why and, and the vision, what you want to achieve. I mean, the, the customer, of course, and the business value, what's in it. And thirdly, I would say just to team up in a, in a context with your management team or your leaders uh, to set the, the group that will drive this transformation uh, by leaders but also with ambassadors or teams uh, above the management team. Once again you have to lead by example. It's okay that you as a leader say yeah, we tried, didn't work out so let's try again in a new way. So that's uh, back to management but also have the uh, processes and the method when you innovate dealing with failure as well. If you drive innovation uh, and transformation, if it's a digital one or, or not, you have to be passionate about it yourself, you have to really believe in it, otherwise they will know that it's not uh, genuine, so that's maybe the last word. So, If you're not there 100% yourself, it's not going to happen.